Hey guys, Brickpan Studios here, back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing this Elsa mini doll that I got from the free market yesterday. And as you can see, it's actually based on the mini doll that was from the Ice Power set that came out last year. Let's take a closer look at it and move the um, snow gear out of the way. But I really like the detail on this. It really improved the detail on the Elsa mini dolls over the years. As you can see, she also has her ice power blast right there. The head is a bit loose, which is kind of unfortunate. Because this isn't an official Lego mini doll. So as you can see, it's really loose. I mean, it still stays on there, but it's really loose. You can move the head really fast. And take a closer look at the hair. It's actually a hard plastic, which I don't know why Lego doesn't make... Didn't make the heart plastic hair piece for the on Elsa and Anna minifigures and mini dolls for the Disney line. And plus, this is the easier way to get that new cape because I didn't, I don't have the right money to get the ice palace. So this is a cheaper option to get that cape for a different official Elsa mini doll. Well, but anyways, guys, that's all for this video. I really think this is a really great mini doll. Even if it's something that's not official Lego, it's still really great. The only thing is, I wish the hair color was the right, you know, blonde color. It's supposed to be platinum blonde, not bright yellow. And also, I wish the head wasn't so loose. And it does come with the snow gi right here. But honestly, I don't think this is bad for being a non-Lego official mini doll. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.